<laughs> I've tried to start this video so many times I just got the giggles and I cannot help it hey guys welcome back to my channel today we're talking about some more boxy charm and we have the first look at the first full variation for the July box so I'm so happy for this um, it looks like it's gonna be a pretty good box um, really really quickly the things that we are gonna get that we are confirmed um, wait I forgot my whole intro. Um, if you're new here, my name is Elizabeth, and I'm, I'm hoping you take a moment to hit that subscribe button, become part of the Wolf Pack today, and let's get into it. All right, now let's try that again. So, I'm gonna do a really quick recap of the box that we know so far. So, I, there was a new video released on Instagram, and I will make sure I include her Instagram handle down below. She's absolutely stunning crazy pretty girl um but she put up the entire box she put up the entire box in her instagram stories and okay, okay i gotta stop getting ahead of myself she did post a picture of the eyeshadow palette the natural goddess palette from butter london and okay i'm just saying like the company who does the product shots for that is okay like it's fine it's pretty this girl put up some good pictures and i'm gonna make sure i include the whole video clip here for you um, she took some really, really good pictures of it, and she did some swatches of it that look absolutely stunning. I'm getting more and more hyped up for that palette, and that green in there is just calling my name. It's just, I'm very curious to see what people are going to be doing with it as far as looks, because the, the two matte shades are kind of limiting. There's not really a transition shade to get you started, and it's just basically a super, super deep brown. And then that blue, I'm curious... I'm curious to see how people use this palette. It's going to be very interesting. And she did show off the the superfood from Elemis, the mask. So she did have that in there. But, oh, sorry. <laughs> and also, sorry, I'm so excited. Um, and also, the Luxie Beauty brushes. She took another great shot of that one as well. Got really, really close to it. So you can see exactly what the brushes look like. And I was wrong about what the the detail crease brush looks like what i had compared it to in my collection is wrong it was not that at all but i i'm even more excited seeing her photos on it because now i can i know what they are i'm just so excited sorry i don't know how many times i can say this so i should probably turn it into a drinking game um but anyways the newest things that she showed in her video is that we're gonna be getting another eyeliner um it's a pencil eyeliner from appeal cosmetics and it's a gel liner gel liners are really really good if you want to do it in the waterline a lot of times they're less likely to um, move around smudge if you have watery eyes which I do I have allergies and my eyes tend to water up so much if I wear a liner on the lower lash line it has to be a gel all the others just make a big old mess and nobody wants to see that um, but the color that she's showing it looks like a real pretty blue um, I guess that's to go with the palette but that would pair her really really well and the next product this is the surprise and no my hair is a surprise too i this is like my day this is either my day two no 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 this is either day three or four hair i only wash my hair a couple times a week because i'm trying to um recover it i'm trying to take better care of it where it became damaged and i'm trying not to wash it as much and let it heal and do masks and things like that and my hair is super, super flat like crazy today, and I didn't know what I was going to do with it. That's why I've been wearing it up, because it's just been where I'm training my hair a little bit more, because I did, I should do a whole separate video on that. Anyways, my hair is super flat and kind of weird looking, and I tried to straighten it to get the bumps out of it where I had it up. And then I was like, man, my hair just looks flat. It just looks bad. So I decided to go in the other direction. Like, I'm not the type of person who curls hair. Um... I'm not I'm, I'm new to hair I'm new to doing hair and so I actually curled it with my straightening iron and actually let the curls set let them cool completely before I tried to brush them out actually I did brush them out with a hairbrush I tried to do it with my fingers but anyways this isn't what you guys wanted to know the sorry sidetrack <laughs> but the real star of the new spoilers is from Alamar Cosmetics I Mm. You know, she did say that there was going to be more products in there and that there were going to be new releases, things like that. She said this a while back and we hadn't heard anything about it. I thought she was just referencing the blush palette, which that one, I do like that palette. I got the, the light one. 
has some orange shades in there that some people may not like, but I, I do like it. It complements my skin tone well. But it looks like this is, it looks like a lip product. This is a brand new release. I don't know anything about it. I've got my phone here, sorry. Um, but the picture that she posted on here, I thought it was going to be like a liquid lipstick because she has a gloss, but this is extremely pigmented. It's a real pretty nude color, but it's super glossy. So maybe it's another nude gloss. Um, but it looks almost too pigmented. You know whenever people say it's like a glossy liquid lipstick or it's a, um, a matte gloss. You know, they kind of do that weird crossover thing. I'm wondering if that's what she did with this. And I don't recognize the packaging. Um, it kind of... It's not bad looking, the packaging. I kind of wish she would went a little bit differently with it because it's... I don't know, I think it's just that color is throwing me off and then it turns into the nude. I don't know. I think the gradient, if it had been like a white or something light colored, it would look better. That color is just kind of throwing me off a bit. Is everything that is in the box you guys that is our first official variation and I I had planned on doing my whole makeup and everything for a video today but I did my hair and I was watching mother on Netflix no we were watching something I fell asleep I took a nap in the afternoon I love some mid-afternoon naps just saying um, so I took a nap and I woke up and mother was on on Netflix or I am mother and I started watching that and I finished it and then I realized crap Where's the day gone? So, no makeup, no nothing. I did my skincare today, and that's as far as I got. <laughs> I did my hair, fell asleep on it, like in the recliner, and ugh, I passed out. <laughs> All right, guys, comment down below what you think of the newest spoilers. Are you excited for them, or are you kind of let down? Because I know, especially when it comes to eyeliner and Appeal Cosmetics, a lot of people have some opinions about it, or they think that it's more like a filler product. I don't know if this is a variation that we've gotten before in the past, so I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I love you so much. I hope you take the time to hit that subscribe button, join the wolf pack today, and I will see you very soon on another video. Bye!